Hi everybody, welcome to Akata TV. Today we'll be talking about top 10 places to visit during vacation in Lagos. Make sure you watch until the end because you definitely don't want to miss the coolest information we will be sharing with you straight away. Now, again and again, you'll hear me tell you about the awesomeness that Nigeria exudes in terms of rich art, culture and hospitality of the people. Although Abuja is Nigeria's capital, the former capital, Lagos, which now represents the commercial orb of the country, is one place you do not want to leave in a hurry. Lagos is the first stop for international travelers who get to scent Nigerian air as soon as they step down from the Muritala Muhammad International Airport. Now, here's a quick story about Lagos. The city was originally founded by the Awori subgroup of the Yoruba people in the 15th century who called it Eko. However, in 1472, the Portuguese explorer Rui de Sequeira who visited the area named it Lago de Curamo. It is assumed that the current name is a corrupt form of the Portuguese name which means lakes or lagoon. Following the amalgamation of the North and South Protectorate in 1914, Lagos automatically became the capital of Nigeria until 1991 when the capital was moved to Abuja. But Lagos remains one of the biggest African cities with a population of over 18 million people and remains a strong economic center of the country. Now, if you're traveling into the country, I've made a list of the top 10 places to visit in Lagos and have fun before proceeding to anywhere else. Here we go! Number 10. Get Arena Located directly opposite the Palms Shopping Mall, go-karting is a typical example of a break from the norm where children and adults get to race in open-wheel carts. It is usually great activity for kids who really enjoy it. Get Arena also has a bar and an arcade with a wall climbing section. The Get Arena will be an awesome choice. Number 9. Freedom Park Now Freedom Park, it used to be a 19th century prison. It is now armed with memorials, fountains, art sites, food courts and more. It is a full leisure park where people organize picnics, shows and concerts and definitely one of the spots to visit in Lagos. Number 8. Takwa Bay Now, you might want a loud and crazy beach party. There are plenty of those in Lagos from the Eleguchi Beach in LA Champagne to the La Capaine Tropicana Beach Resort among others. But if you want some private fun with just friends and family, Takwa Bay is the place, free of loud noises and crowds. And for surfers, there's no better place to test your jet skiing and water skiing skills than at Takwa Bay. Number 7. New Africa Shrine So, sometimes last year, a friend who had recently developed interest in the music of the late fella Nicola Kokuti asked me where it could reflect on the life of one of Africa's greatest musicians. No other thought came to mind than the shrine. This time, the New African Shrine. Located at Ikeja, the shrine is definitely one of the hottest fun spots to visit, especially during the annual celebration of Fela, known as Felabration Music Festival. Currently managed by Fela's son, Sheon, who is also an artist, the New Africa Shrine showcases some of Fela's artwork and also serves as a rendezvous hub with occasional performances by various artists including Femi Kuti. So if you're looking to experience some mini Fela sound and pure African genre, you should visit the shrine and you'll get a plus because of its proximity to the site on. Number 6. The Kalakuta Republic Museum Kalakuta Republic was the name of the place where Fela, his band and family members lived. The museum is replete with artistic details that tell the story of Fela's music, activism and unusual lifestyle. It is indeed one of the top spots to visit in Lagos. Number 5. Nike Center for Art and Culture the Nigerian National Museum is not the only place to find collection of art. You'll find fine art in Nike Center for Art and Culture, founded by Nike Davies Okundae, whose humble beginnings without a university degree to delivering lectures at Harvard University has increased the popularity of the gallery. There, you will find art in varied forms from paintings, drawings, stones, beads, adire to life-size arts. 
Entry into the center comes at no cost, but you'll definitely be lured to buy a piece of art. Number 4. The Nigerian National Museum the Nigerian National Museum, founded in 1957, hosts important collections of Nigerian art, including archaeological and ethnographic exhibits. It is a great place to learn about Nigerian history. Number 3. Terra Culture – Love the Arts Terra Culture, owned by Bolanli Austin Peters, is where you'll find an art gallery, theatre, art and craft store, all in one building. Terra Culture is a great place to visit in Lagos if you're looking to connect with Nigerian art and culture, especially at times when the popular Nigerian stage play, Waka the Musical, is being performed. But if there are no performances on the day of your visit, you can still check out the art gallery, bookstore and an attached restaurant with quality Nigerian food. Number 2. Lekki Conservation Center you want to see plants and wildlife in their natural habitat, Lekki Conservation Center is the place to go. This zone is a huge expanse of green space that exudes peace. The long canopy walk, sight of monkeys, birds and other animals is absolutely gratifying. So if you're visiting Nigeria and you consider Lagos the site of a mad city, you'll definitely find peace and the splendor of nature in this center. A couple of honorable mentions before number one is the Ikeja City Mall, Palms Mall, and other malls that house shopping halls, cinemas, spas, game centers, beauty rooms, among other relaxation spots. There is Jazz Hall in Ikoyi, Lekki Leisure Lake, and many more places, but at number one, Badagri Town. If you're black, African, or just passionate about the history of black people and how our ancestors were shipped away from western countries as slaves, Badagri is the place to visit. The Badagri Black Heritage Museum still contains relics like chains and other items used as a transaction in the exchange of slaves. Badagri, located between Lagos and the Seme border, is historic as it is the location of the first story building in Nigeria and other historical buildings in Nigeria. While there, you will get to cross the lagoon in order to begin the journey of no return, in honor of slaves who made their journey to foreign countries and never returned home. Badagri is home to some decent beaches, which makes for a worthwhile day trip from Lagos. So, Lagos welcomes you into the orb of work and fun. Next time, we will bring you details of places to visit in Nigeria. Subscribe and turn on notification so you don't miss more videos on vital information about fun places in Nigeria and much more. My name is Tolu Koladi. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.